Hello everyone, it's your boy Kaz, founder of The Urban Hazar and the Facebook community Beards, Barbells and Banner. I hope you are doing as well as you possibly can be doing up here in my tavern. I will serve you my finest ale to make you feel as comfortable as you can. And today, we're doing my long beard minoxidil routine. So, you really are just using gravity to your advantage with this strategy. And all you really need Grab one milliliter of minoxidil uh, in your little dropper here, and uh, preferably you would need a wooden comb. Okay, uh, my wooden comb is actually in the other room. Uh, I don't, <laughs> I actually don't know where it is. I have to go find it. But uh, for, for the time being, I'm going to use my uh, my plastic comb. Uh, wooden combs tend to spread things like oils a, a lot easier, and it um, it doesn't stick as much uh, to like it does to the plastic comb. But this will do. So. What you're doing is you're using gravity to your advantage, right? It's pretty simple, really. I, I have to get my mustache out of the way because it kind of uh, gets annoying. So, so what we're doing is just very slightly releasing the minoxidil, okay, all the way down the face, allowing it to run down the face, and then doing this cross motion here. And really, guys, we're, we're covering the entirety of the cheeks by doing this. Right? I can feel it on my skin everywhere by doing this, right? And the same goes, you know, you can do it. Uh, I, I, haven't, I haven't applied minoxidil to the entirety of my face in the longest time. I've just been doing the cheeks. But uh, so, you know, I, I, I used to apply like this to the underlip all the way around underneath the mustache, right? Cross motion. Just use the gravity to its advantage. You can do this with the gobbler area too, right? Just release some minoxidil all the way down. Cross motion. So, is this 100% optimal? No. <laughs> As I mentioned earlier, guys, it, for most individuals, even if your beard if, if your beard responds well to minoxidil, it, you know it's it's better off if you keep your beard to a short stubble. But if you truly truly want, uh, if you truly truly want a long beard and you want it now, like I did, then this is probably your best bit. This using gravity and then the cross motion, right? And, uh, you know, I, I pretty much have my whole face covered right now. I'm not going to do this cheek because it's really awkward because uh, my, my uh, uh, display camera, uh, my, my display screen on my camera is kind of in a weird spot. I wouldn't be able to see it. Uh, but if, if, I'm, if I was looking in the mirror, I'd be able to do it. So that's basically it. And of course, if you wanted to do your mustache too, you got to grab a little more here. All right. So if you have a big mustache like mine, just releasing a very small amount. Cross motion. Just using gravity at this point, guys. Beautiful. So there we go, guys. Let me know what you guys think. If you like the video, if it's helpful to you, please like, please, 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 please press like and share and have a great night, guys. I hope to see you in the next video.